so today in this video we will discuss uh, one activity from your syllabus that is uh, to study the effect of intensity uh, by varying the distance from the of the source on LDR right this is a LDR you can see we will we'll also do this uh, activity and uh, many of you have asked uh, that uh, how to write the or how to uh, maintain your notebook for the uh, your uh, activities you know six activities for this year you have to do uh, if you see the syllabus there are two sections right section a and section b section a three activities section b also three activities so six acti activities you have to do right so for six activities uh, this is from section b one activity from section b already i have act, uh, uploaded few activities and uh, some of you have seen it so uh, this one is uh, to study the effect of intensity so we'll study that uh, how uh, if we'll put some light on it how the intensity of that light um, is uh, changing the resistance of this uh, ldr so this uh, LDR that is a light dependent resistance it will change means the resistance value will change we will connect this this is your LDR right this type of uh, structure and this LDR will connect to a multimeter right and here we will put some light source on it uh, so that uh, we will and we will move this light source away and we will measure the distance right this is how, how we will uh, write in a tabular form right distance for 10 centimeter let's say distance uh, 15 centimeter 20 centimeter three different distance and we'll see that uh, what are the readings in the uh, multimeter right uh, multimeter ohm uh, will keep the knob will keep towards the ohm so we'll measure the resistance in multimeter and we'll take it uh, right in a tabular form so some of you are confused at how to write uh, activity uh, shall we write uh, like a practical or uh, experiments or shall we write like uh, uh, just uh, diagrams and all these things so it's better uh, if you draw some diagram okay uh, first you write what is the aim of your activity then what are the apparatus you are using like you have done the experiment same way you can do here uh, mostly the calculation part is uh, not there uh, only the observation part will be there right that is the difference between the activity and uh, experiment for uh, means you can just think of and one activity you have to do in the practical means during your exam also right and this year i have been uh, i'll go for a external to to a school so uh, so uh, some instruction uh, that i'll share also that what to do what to not to do during the exam so and also oh, what are the viva probable viva questions they may ask right and these LDRs are used uh, uh, many times uh, in the automation of street light right when light will incident on uh, this uh, LDR uh, what will happen uh, its resistance will will see that the resistance is decreasing the more intense light will be uh, will be there on the LDR the resistance will decrease the uh, when we will take the source away that means distance will increase low light will incident that time resistance will be high so resistance will be high then we will connect it with the ic circuit and uh, ic and uh, it will be on condition so at night the street bulb will glow at daylight when uh, light will be there maximum intensity output will be maximum right resistance will decrease that time uh, the ic will be off condition it will so it works as a that type of sensor one type of sensor you can say uh, in street lights and many other applications like sensor uh, in different camera sensor also sometimes it is used to identify the um, what are the light exposure outside light it's day light uh, night like that in, inside the camera in many there are many applications of this uh, ldrs right so you can uh, read for the viva also sometimes the external may ask okay so how will you write in the uh, we'll go to the activity uh, but just uh, uh, have a look that how to write because in the last videos of activities i have not explained in detail some of you are saying that sir you should uh, explain in detail that how to uh, write and uh, explain what how to do the activity so first uh, you will write the m right and activity also you should remember three marks are there for you uh, for the uh, notebook and uh, your viva so uh, first you will write m apparatus like you write in a uh, uh, your experiment then you will write concept of theory what is ldr just two three line not more 
right in experiment you should elaborately write uh, everything but here just two three lines what is the concept what is ldr the light dependent resistance which uh, in uh, the resistance which depend upon the intensity of the light and we use it in many uh, suppose two three examples you can give then this one this one now procedure procedure you will write what are you doing right you will write that we are we arranged it uh, the ldr is connected to a multimeter only few lines three four lines not more than that Right, don't spend too much time on this experiment and uh, your uh, activities. Uh, but you should be careful because it's 30 marks also. Uh, you should be careful. You should write neatly and understand the experiment. Do it properly. Right. So when uh, light will incident on this LDR, you will write that. Uh, will give. Uh, our, will allow the source of source light source to uh, incident uh, light on this LDR, and will connect the LDR with the multimeter, keeping the Ohm um, multimeter knob in the ohm mode, right? So uh, multimeter knob will be uh, in the ohm towards the ohm. And what will what will do? We'll keep the uh, source gradually. We'll make uh, take the source gradually away from the uh, your uh, LDR, and we'll note down that different distance. What are the resistance we are getting? Just three four line procedure. Then table you will do same table whatever we are getting. Right, then you will write conclusion. Conclusion you will write that you will see that when distance is increasing, the resistance is decreasing. When we are taking the source away from the your uh, LDR, you will see that the resistance uh, on the uh, your multimeter is showing that gradually it's decreasing. Okay, so this is uh, resistance is decreasing, uh, distance is increasing, and precaution whatever the, the connection should be proper, the light uh, should be held parallel to properly. Right, so as a this distance you are holding like this, this distance you are holding like this, so obviously the result will vary, right? So it should be proper parallel, you should fix on a vertical way so that you, it will not uh, shake like that, two, three precaution you, you can write, right? So this is, this is how you should write the, uh, your activity. Now let us go to the activity and uh, let us see that how to connect this one with uh, a multimeter and take the readings. Now our apparatus are ready, uh, you can see this is our LDR, right, you can see LDR, we have our multimeter ready, now multimeter this is, is ohm symbol, so it starts from this line to here to here, this is 200 ohm range, this is 2k, 2 kilo ohm, 20 kilo ohm, 200 uh, kilo ohm, 2 mega ohm, right, so this is the range, so let us uh, keep in 200 kilo ohm, okay or 20 kilo ohm, let us see how, what is the range, if it is out of range then we will change it. So this is our multimeter, now how will you connect the multimeter, uh, you see the red is here and the black is at the common, the C ohm written, this is a common, right. So this is the two wires you will connect, now what you will do, I have a, I have this one, so to hold the multimeter properly right so that it will not uh, it will be hold properly with this one okay so with this holder i am now other end of this wire i will connect to the ldr right this is a connecting wire this is a connecting wire that one end will connect to the LDR like this. Okay, let me open it. Okay, it's better. Yeah. And then now I'll I'll not uh, connect the circuit. Let me open. Connect the LDR first. Make LDR stretch a little bit so that it won't attach. Yeah. So with the two pins of the LDR, I'll connect two wires. Uh, you can directly connect the multimeter to the two knob. But I am doing it because uh, I have to, I am doing it alone. So this is my LDR and 
what I'll do now one end is here you can see the reading okay let light on so now what I'll do this is your idea okay now what I'll do I'll just touch it you can see you can see what is the reading see the reading see the reading it's uh, around 86 90 kilo right now uh, my room light is on now let me hide it you see the resistance is decreasing now my light is okay so light is there uh, it, it's bearing it's bearing because it's my room light okay it's bearing okay so you can see it's bearing 9 like that 9 8.5 so if i yeah so if i'm hiding with my hand this is a real layer okay See, this is the LDR. Okay, this is the LDR. If I'll hide it, see 150, 1, 142 kilo ohm. If I'm removing the room light, it's 8, it's around 8, 9. Right? You can see it. Let me on the light. Yeah, you can see clearly. Now 9, 10 with the room light, with the tube light. Now if I'll hide it, you see how the resistance is increasing. Now, because more light will incident, resistance will decrease, right? So you see, okay? Now we'll do the experiment. This is my touch. This is my touch. Okay, I'll switch off the light of my room and we'll have this one with different distances. Just I'll move, keep it like this, this way. Okay, I'll take, I'm not measuring the distance. I'll, I'm measuring the approximate distance, but you can do it with proper taking a meter scale and fixing it to one place you can measure so room is off light is off now you see and now you see the multimeter reading you see when light is light incident on the LDR resistance is 0 0.6 kilo ohm you can see this is the distance right you see the distance it's around 10 centimeter it's around 10 centimeter when the light is there on the LDR you can see the resistance check 0 0.3 0 0.4 look at the look at the reading of the multimeter here 0 0.5 ohm now let me take the touch away the light source away now you see how the resistance will increase now I'm taking it away. Now I'm taking it more away. Now I'm taking farther away. You see, increasing. Now it's six. Now it's six. Now it's six. So it's increasing. I'm taking it out away, away, farther. You see, it's increasing. It's increasing. Eight, seven, eight. Fluctuating. Ten, eleven right show the edge you can see again i'm taking close you see 0 0.4 0 0.5 0. see so as the light incident on the ldr the resistance is changing and it is dependent upon the distance so the source light if it is near to the ldr the resistance is less if I am taking it away, that means intensity is decreasing. So intensity decreasing and resistance is increasing. This is the conclusion. Thank you for watching. See you in another video.